Hi, I'm Marissa Meyer, and I'm Vice President of Search and User Experience at Google. And today at the Google headquarters, we've hosted Searchology, which is a conference where we announce new features for Search. And today we've had three really exciting new releases. Uh, so first up, we have a new Search Options panel, which launched on our Search Results page today. And this allows our users to visualize and search and slice and dice their searches in entirely new ways. Can they see things on the timeline? Can they use our new wonder wheel? Can they get the most recent results? Can they drill into a particular genre? There's a ton of new tools in the search options panel that can actually be combined in any number of ways to really provide unique views onto your search results. The next thing we previewed was Google Squared, which will be appearing on Google Labs later this month. And Google Squared is the ability to actually do an entire research task with one search. So one of the examples we showed was for example was small dogs and when you search on small dogs we actually find a list of different breeds of small dogs and all the attributes about them and we actually put it into a matrix so you can see the name of the dog, pictures, descriptions, height, weight, you can do all the comparisons across all the values. You can also morph the script. You can add columns, new breeds, you can add new columns uh, with new attributes, and we're really excited with how that whole piece comes together. Because data extraction is one of the hardest problems in computer science, and Google Squared is a big leap forward in terms of how that works. And then the final search announcement we had was rich snippets. And we're going to take the description text and excerpted text that appears on our search results page, and in some cases, when it really helps our users, augment it with additional rich information. So for example, from a reviews site, we might summarize the reviews. How many stars um, on average is there? How many reviews are there uh, on this particular site or product? For people, we can tell you where they are and what their profession is vis-a-vis -vis information and metadata on LinkedIn. And there's just a lot of, of elements we can introduce to the search world page. So we're launching with preliminary partners like CNET and Yelp and LinkedIn, and we're hoping to add more. But what's really great about this is it's built on an open standard of APIs, where webmasters can add these values directly into their HTML, and then when Google calls them, we can include this in our search results when it's most helpful to our users. And then finally, with a little bit of whimsy, we closed with a new Android application on the Android phone that actually helps people search the stars. It's your very own planetarium because you can search for, say, a particular constellation, and your Android phone, using the GPS in it as well as the accelerometer, will coach you where to look in the sky to see it. So not only are we doing a better job finding information on the web, we're now helping people find physical things. We've always hypothesized that maybe someday Google will help you find your keys. Today we're helping you find the stars, and we're certainly attempting to reach for the stars in terms of providing better and better search for our users. Thanks.